Hey. hey. Hey, everybody. That was so weird. That is not what I usually say. Hi. Welcome into another video. So. Oh, God, that really actually kind of burned. It caused the fire. Um, whoa, calluses. Anyway, sorry, I'm a gym bro these days. Nothing there. Hello, welcome into another video. We're here, we're sitting down because we've got a new trailer for Heartstopper. Now, as you guys probably know, if not, if you're new, hello, maybe consider subscribing. Um, I'm a big fan of Heartstopper. Hello. Um, and also, you'll see new addition, not not new in my life, like I've, ha I've had it for a while, but new to the background. Red, white and royal blue. Ro red, wi red, white and royal blue. That is a tongue twister. They've released a new Heartstopper trailer. Right, we're going to be doing that. That's a given. I asked you guys. You guys said you wanted it. I had some time today, so why not? Um, but I thought to beef out this video a little bit more, because otherwise it'd be pretty short, which is fine. But I like them long. <laughs> um, I thought, seeing as I got loads and loads and loads of people asking me to react to the trailer for Red, Red White and Royal Blue, the movie that's coming out, obviously, in August, um, I thought that I would also react to that. Sound good? For those of you asking, obviously there is going to be reactions to Heartstopper. You guys know this already. In terms of red, red, white, and royal blue, I'm going to be doing a reaction to the movie, but it's going to be when I come back off, come back off of my holiday because I go on holiday on the 15th, and I believe the movie comes out on the 11th. So I think I'd rather get all the Heartstoppers done and then do that when I come back. So hopefully that's okay with you guys. Um, but yeah, with all that said. Let's get into the video. Check me out on Instagram if you would like to. It'll be up on the screen somewhere. Check me out on Spotify, Twitter, Patreon, Discord, and TikTok. All linked down below. Check out my new merch and you might see uh, I'm wearing a piece. This is my more than seasonal pride collection. This is the Life's Too Short Not To Be Gay t-shirt. On the back we do have, if I can show you, a, a, a gumball machine with lots of fruity flavored bubble gum because gay. Um, but we have five designs. Check it out, everpress.com. With all that said, I guess, let us go. Nick. <laughs> Hi. Oh, well, we've, we've seen this. This was in the teaser. I have a boyfriend. Yes, we're all fully aware. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Sorry, I'm gonna pause quite a bit, so I'm sorry about it, but it is what it is. The way, first of all, the way Nick said hi at the beginning, that kind of got me going. Is this gonna be a saucy season? Like spicy in terms of like kissing and stuff? Because I'm not sure if I'm ready for that. These are young boys. Come on. So much kissing, oh my God. I want to tell people. He wants to tell people. I mean, I knew this was gonna happen, of course. Like, how would they not do that? But he wants to tell people, oh my God, oh my God. It's scary. I just know, guys, I know I'm going to be traumatized. It's going to be so homophobic. <laughs> Your friend group is so nice. How did you get to know everyone? Uh, well, um. <laughs> wait, wait, no, this is, guys, this is going to be good. I can already see it. I can already tell. But the whole... I said this in in my podcast that I did where I kind of predict Heartstopper season two without obviously having read the books because I know that I've got them, I've not read them. I said in that that I think that kind of like Nick is going to be a kind of a gateway into Imogen becoming a bit more a part of the friendship group. And I mean, she just said right there, your friendship group's so nice. Like, how did you get to know them all? I want you to come out when and how you want to. Yeah! Boyfriend! How is the worst person to have a crush on? What if you don't actually fair with him? My mum's been moaning at me to get a haircut. Your hair's cute, Mom. Oh no, are we gonna actually make a whole big deal? See, I, I did wonder when we were obviously watching, watching this trailer that he still had his old hair. I didn't know we were actually gonna make a big deal out of the hair. I thought it was just gonna be like a, a subtle change that like obviously we recognize, but they're not gonna talk about. But wait, it's gonna be a whole plot point. I am very much into that because that boy, he needed it. He needed the snip, you know? <laughs> I love you. That's not me asking you to say it back or anything. Yeah. Does Charlie know you don't wanna come out? I do want to come out. Is everyone ready for Paris? Yeah! I'm jealous of you and Nick in some ways. 
You talk about your feelings. Oh no. See, that's that's where Tara and Darcy are gonna go. Because obviously in the first season, we had the whole like Tara struggling being a lesbian and Darcy was kind of like the strong one out of the two and like that kind of thing. T Darcy's gonna find it hard to talk about her feelings and love and shit in this one. Oh, that's such a great way of going. But I know I'm gonna cry. Unfortunately, yes. And also Ben. I know I only flashed up there, but I'm triggered already. All right, I don't need that. Nick doesn't have to deal with one. Ah! Everything's gonna be perfect. Oh, but I know it's not gonna be. Oh my God. Oh my God, oh my hickey. God hickey. Do you think anyone will notice? Oh my God. <laughs> I've liked him for so long. Sometimes I think he might like me back. Oh, and the, huh? I'm sure obviously them them two seeing Nick and Charlie like trying to really give it you know like that's only going to make it more difficult and like them like each other more because they're going to see what they have and they're going to want it oh I hope the whole season we're not going to be like will they won't they will they won't leave but I know Netflix I know they will <laughs> they are going to be a handful today mm -hmm. I'm so excited to get more Isaac. Johnny! Oh, you're being gay. Good job. <laughs> Carry on. Oh, I love Darcy's witch. That is brilliant. Oh, you're being gay. Braille. Oh, Darcy. I'm so excited for more of like the one-liners. Oh, this has been a good trailer, hasn't it? They really snapped and I'm looking like the same fucking color as my hair, so that's great. Oh, that's got me so much more. I mean, I was already excited, but that's got me even more excited. Oh, good God. It's gonna be such a good season, I can already tell, because I know for a fact we're gonna be getting into more mature stuff. And I think, obviously, like the very beginning was obviously them trying to find their footing and like, I imagine they probably didn't want to hit us with so much trauma, but now, like with obviously Nick struggling with coming out and like relationships kind of developing, it kind of opens up more doors for more stress and more like real, real, real problems. Do you know what I mean? And like telling people, oh my God, that is going to be traumatizing for so many of us. Now don't get me wrong, I didn't have a brutal coming out. Like as far as they go, mine was pretty nice and easy. But I know so many people haven't. But anyway, guys, I'm well excited. So that was the Heartstopper one. I guess let's get into the red, white, and royal blue one because you guys have honestly been hammering me to watch this. And I was gonna, I wanted to watch it, but I thought it would just be a really short video if I just did that. So obviously with this also coming out, it just makes sense to do both. Simple instructions. This is gonna be like Bridgerton, but gay, isn't it? Oh, hi. How's it going? Thanks the cake. See, I recall that. That was towards the beginning of the book, the whole cake fiasco. I do remember that. Oh, good God. Wait, they're both sexy. You can hate Prince Henry all you want. Oh, my God, they're both attractive. Be still, my beating vagina. Now that too, sweetheart. You better act like the sun shines out of his ass and you have a vitamin D deficiency. Oh, that was a line. That was a line. Did y'all hear that? You best act like the sun shines out of his ass and you have a vitamin D for deficiency. There's so much there to unpack. Like, what? Is he going to gobble on his ass cheeks? Because, I mean, I'm into it. But she I don't think she quite knew what she did there. <laughs> but I won't. Did I do something wrong? Just thick as it gets. Whoa! Whoa! That's so ballsy, but I guess it's a prince though. I mean, are they both princes? I don't know if they're both princes. I think I think the, the blonde hair's a prince. But I guess as a prince though, like what's, what's gonna happen? Like you could ruin his life if he said it out, do you know what I mean? Open his head! But that is so ballsy. Like I'm assuming he's, he probably had some sort of inkling that he was into him, but um, um, this is not so hard for gay people because we have it so hard. We can't just walk up to someone and ask them out. Like I would, 
I mean, I'd never do that because I'm scared, but I'd like the option. You know what I mean? Because then like, there's always the option of them being straight and then being offended that you thought that they were, that you thought that they were gay and then them being homophobic. So. so I love you. What I oh, and we're both going to get to know each other's backgrounds in life. I miss you. If anyone sees you leave this hotel, I will Brexit your head from your body. <laughs> Your Royal Highness. <laughs> I love that queen. I, I don't know if she's the queen. I'm not meaning that. I just love her. She seems great. She seems like a very like, it gives like personal assistant. I love like publicist kind of vibe, you know, like in control of like all the questions and stuff. <gasps> Do you love him? What difference would it make if I did? I won. Oh no, it's gonna make me sad. It's like there's a rope attached to my chest and it keeps pulling me towards you. Hopefully we'll get through tonight without any more scandals. <laughs> oh my god, they're so cute. What the fuck? The night is young, Ma. That's what I want. Guys, no, that's also got the potential to really hurt me. Because it's going to be, well, of course it's going to be difficult because of the fucking prince. This is going to be like young, royal, but, young royals, but English. And a bit more grown up. Oh, for God's sake. I'm, a, I'm in for a traumatizing August, aren't I? And it's my birthday. Guys, 17th of August, Matty Calendars. Right? I'm gonna be in Gran Canaria sunning it up. Anyway, with all that said, this does bring us to the end of this video. I'm very excited for both, to be honest. Oh, and I've got a feeling red, white, and royal blue is gonna be spice. I tell you what, the added layer of like someone being like a royal really does spice things up. I mean, we saw it with young royals, do you know what I mean? But anyway, hopefully you enjoy this video. I'm, pr I'm sure it's probably been pretty short, but um, yeah, I'll see you again here. What is it, next week or something? Guys, next week, next Thursday. I'll see you back here probably the weekend though, because I, I doubt I'll get a, an episode up on Thursday. But um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe and check out my other videos if you'd like to. Check out the merch once again. It's really wonderful and I love it. But anyway, love yous. Bye.